definition of marriage to grow you up. It's a laboratory. And so if you run at the first sign of trouble, you'll stay immature and you won't bear the image. And so sometimes you never get to what God will have you to get because you get this divorce and you get this divorce and you, you break up with this person, you break up with this person, and you're all alone. Never becoming better because two is better than one. And so, yes, they're different than you. And so when you realize that and you begin to mature in a relationship, it's literally a gospel reenactment in your marriages and in your relationships. You begin to mature at the end of your relationship where you get to a place where you not only appreciate your differences, you celebrate them. I celebrate the fact that Pastor Mon is different than me. We got each other's back. It covers our strengths and our weaknesses. I thank God that he has a different perspective. We're one in Christ. We agree on some things. And that's the thing. You out here dating and being with people that don't know nothing about Jesus. And that's why you married him and you struggle. Because to be unequally yoked is hard, y'all.